Hi, I'm Felicity. We know now that pharmaceutical antibiotics are no longer working as well as they used to. In fact, if you have a weak immune system, an antibiotic can kill you. So let's have a get well, stay well look at the tried and trusted natural ways that work and are not toxic. Oregano and oil of oregano contain carvacrol, which is an antibacterial. I was thrilled to be given a little bottle of this as a gift when I graduated it as a health educator from Hippocrates Health Institute in Florida. Of course, the Americans pronounce it oregano. However you pronounce it though, it works. Apple cider vinegar is a good old family favorite as well. It's a natural antibiotic, an antiseptic and an alkalizer. Raw honey has been used from Roman times to treat wounds and prevent infection. It's also antimicrobial, anti-inflammatory and antibacterial. I learned a lot about manuka honey while training in New Zealand. Their native manuka has been found to have the highest level of antioxidants and curative abilities. I wonder if you like curries. You can get your antibiotics from turmeric. You can also drink turmeric as a delicious nut milk drink. It also works as a paste on the skin. And what about garlic? Garlic contains allicin. Not the girl's name, Allison, but Allison, spelt with a C in the middle. It fights the common cold, yeasts, parasites, and bacteria. Easy to remember, Dr. Allison cures colds. For sure, no other doctor can. Have your garlic raw or sizzling in coconut oil. Coconut oil is another amazing healer. Again, it's an antibacterial, antifungal, antiviral, and anti-inflammatory. Why use anything else? Grapefruit seed extract is effective against more than 800 known viruses and bacteria, as well as more than 100 strains of fungi and parasites. Besides boosting antibacterial protection, this extract also alkalizes the body and improves gut flora. Echinacea is a pretty flowering herb which prevents colds. Cabbage is a cruciferous vegetable containing sulfur and vitamin C. Try that old family favorite, bubble and squeak. That's mashed potato and shredded cabbage for the uninitiated. Cabbage is also great when it's a fermented, such as sauerkraut, which renews our intestinal flora. And my last one today is colloidal silver. It disables the enzyme that single cell bacteria need in order to multiply. So spray this in the throat and avoid colds. Use these natural God-given alternatives to get well and stay well inexpensively and safely at home.